security is affecting lives or people's livelihood in Ghana, the member states, especially when you go to the rural areas or the local areas where people are engaged in farming activities. It is seriously affecting the level of investment that people are committing into their agribusiness because if they are not they don't feel secure of the land rights they have they are not ready to do all that it takes to increase the intensity of activity to improve or to even expand on the skills and level of involvement in the land activity in fact in recent times in ghana we have had cases where cocoa farms have been given to small scale miners and they have taken greater parts of the cocoa trees, digging under the cocoa trees for the gold. And so farmers don't have any um, opportunity to continue their farming activities. So what is happening in some of those areas is that even farmers who originally did not want to give out their cocoa farm for such activities are forced to submit to that situation because they are not able to protect themselves. They're not able to get any protection from the system. And the traditional leaders who granted the land are not able to even give them any guarantee of security on their land. So it is a serious situation in Ghana. If we come to the urban areas, it's a thing trying to develop their own small businesses or their um, housing units for them to be able to engage in business activities in their cities. And it's the same. There's chaos in the tenure arrangements, and so many have become victims. And this is creating a lot of tensions for them. So yes, tenure insecurity is a big subject in Ghana. Many don't feel secured. And because of that, people are using all kinds of other means to ensure that they get protection for themselves by employing security men and other things on their land, which is also creating further insecurity for other people around the area.